everyone, it's Tiny Games here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we are doing a Discord Dream Snaps review video. Now I'm doing this one slightly different because I am recording this in advance of me going away to Denmark. So when you see this, I'm actually away enjoying my vacation. <laughs> um, so I am only filming half of the Discord Dream Snaps um for now and then my plan is come uh wednesday or thursday i will film the second half um which will hopefully have everyone's posts included then because i didn't want to do it all too far in advance and then like not include everyone so i've kind of done it a little bit differently so if there's any difference between the two videos in terms of editing or sound or anything like that it's probably down to that um when you do see this video it will i will schedule them so that both videos go live at the same time um or at least half an hour between that's usually how i stagger it so there won't be any disruptions that way it just might be that like as i said the sound or the editing might feel a bit different between the two videos so just to explain that there um but anyway, we're not here for explanations of stuff. We're here to look at the uh, dream snaps that you've all created. So I'm very excited to get into these. I think this challenge, this top it off challenge or whatever it's called, um, is going to be a really interesting one because I think we're going to have a lot of variety with the shots. Um, it does also mean that I think this week will in some ways be a tough week because you genuinely don't know what the other person on the other end is going to be looking for or what their preferences are going to be I feel like this is going to be a very personal kind of like response to some of these submissions um in terms of like what people choose to vote for and stuff because technically so long as you've got a hat you're on theme so so long as i can see a hat in the submission i'm going to be happy and then when it comes down to voting it probably is going to be down to things like composition and stuff like that but then when it comes to voting between two photos with very good composition it's going to come down to personal taste which is quite interesting because usually with some of the other challenges like theme park challenges and stuff like that you can really target your snap to appeal to the masses um if that makes sense whereas this is very hard because you're literally just creating something that you think you might like or enjoy um and not necessarily what others might like and enjoy because that's so hard to tell Anyway, I'm waffling here. You're here to look at Dream Snap submissions. Why am I waffling? Let's jump over to Discord and have a look at what you guys have come up with. So we are starting off strong today with Decorista's submission. And I love this. This feels so elegant. I love the red tones in this photo. Now, I do believe, if I remember correctly, this is a build that you have in your valley that you created inspired by one of the participants in your challenges. So for those that don't know the Decorista, don't follow her channel or things like that, Decorista does um, challenges every so often, um, basically giving um, sort of set tasks for people to come up with. Um, the last one was an artist challenge, so we all had to create builds inspired by artists and their paintings and things like that. So I believe this was inspired by one of your participants in one of the challenges who did like a Hercules mixed with... Uh, Vanellope build or so I, I don't remember entirely you'll have to forgive me and obviously the to the person that originally created this kind of like setup um I apologize for not remembering but I love this I think this works really really well together and you know for something like Vanellope's house the candy's house it can sometimes be really hard to make that look really nice and aesthetic and you've done such a good job here with this um it's such a beautiful build like this mix of candy core with like elegant core it just like it's so bizarre but it works it works and i love this i love the backdrop obviously the outfit is gorgeous the hat is beautiful i love that you've paired it with the gloves and the dress i think that just works so well it's such a beautiful photo so um 
good luck with your submission. I have no doubts that this will do well. Next up, we have Say Hi Joel with this Pirate Core inspired snap, and I love this. I did a pirate inspired snap on my husband's account, and I do wish he had some of these items because they would have just worked so perfectly. So I think this is an amazing snap. Your character looks cool. I love all the treasure, all the barrels. Oh, I wish I'd thought to use barrels. I never thought of that, and it's such a good idea. I love that you've got Skull Rock in the background, and there is a ship also in the background. That's so good. And the parrot, the pirate parrot, the way it's flying right now, you've timed that shot so well. This is such a fantastic submission, so great job. Next up, we have Nia with this submission, and I love this. I love it so much. Okay, yeah, I, I really do. This is kind of like a vibe that I thought about potentially doing with this like big oversized Merlin witch hat kind of thing. Um, This just looks cool. It's so cute. This is such a good photo. You're so good at doing these kind of like close-up shots and I just love them. I think they're so good. I love all the decor in this and everything like that. I... <laughs> Yeah, this is just such a perfect image. It's so good. So well done on this. Next up, we have Wolfie with this Oswald inspired snap. I love that you've gone for the black and white filter on here. I think it works so well, especially for sort of like the scene that you're creating. I did contemplate doing an Oswald inspired snap too, but I didn't do it on my main and I don't have Oswald on my other account. So yeah, <laughs> none of that for me, but I, I do, I love this. I think this is fantastic. This is such a like... Oh, just like a, a beautiful submission. I love that we've got this close-up of the piano and everything like that. It's so elegant. I love the way you've decorated. This is a brilliant snap. Next up, we have Punchy LaRue with this submission. And this is so good as well. I love this. This kind of like cowboy s snap is so good. The image is so cohesive. Um, I love all the elements like the campfire and the tent. Even the way you've framed the photo with the like the cactuses, it just looks so good. And I like that there's a lot of depth and height with this based on where you've taken this submission. I'm not entirely sure what part of the dunes this is taken in, but it certainly looks like we've got quite a bit of height and depth here and it, it just looks really good. Um, I love this. I think this is a fantastic submission. Next up, we have Tawana with this submission, and I love this. This is so cute. I feel like this is such a unique submission, like definitely like girl band, girl group vibes. I love this. I think this is fantastic. I love that you've decorated with all the starlights, the staging with the... um what do you call them? The the curtains. How have you managed to make your curtains line up? Because they never do for me. Like they, I don't know how you managed to do that, but well done. I like the like the plaques on the wall as well. I think they work really, really well. And I love that this is such a cute outfit. Yeah, this is so cute. Very girl band, girl gang kind of vibes. I love it. Fantastic job. Next up, we have Madam Red with this submission. And I love this. Oh my goodness. This is so good. Like this kind of like Scrooge inspired snap. Honestly, so smart, so clever and creative. One, I love the outfit. I think you've done a fantastic job there, like coordinating. I think it just looks so good. Um, I love how you've decorated with all the like gold and the jewels and the gems and things like that. Um, this is, this is so like Scrooge inspired. This is such a fantastic snap. I think you've done such a good job with this. Yeah, this is definitely one of my favorites. I absolutely love this snap. Next up, we have Jolly with this submission, and look how cute this is. That table works so perfectly here in this setup. It's so adorable. I love how it looks like you're having a tea party together. All the floral elements in this uh, submission are so good. I love that we can sort of see into the bakery with the baked goods and everything like that. Such a good touch. Um, all the little details here are so good. Honestly, fantastic job with this one.
Next up, we have Sunny, who has posted free submissions asking for a bit of feedback. I gave my personal feedback already. <laughs> so we'll have to see what you decided to settle with. But we have this first submission, which is very um, elegant core, princess core and things like that. I do love this snap, but I do think that like because I use the bird hat myself, I feel like the bird hat is not elegant enough like is that weird to say because it's obviously a very like posh lady's hat but like i just felt like between the three um i mean this was like my second favorite of the submissions i felt like there was probably like a better hat that could have been used with this maybe even a crown or something like that then we have this one which is your tavern vibes pirate tavern vibes i love this one this was my personal favorite i love that you've used the mannequins and you've got like a group of uh pirates and things like that all hanging out together i think this is a really really good snap i love the angle of it i love all the elements in this photo i think it's so good um and your character looks amazing here too so this is definitely my favorite and then we have this black and white submission which again is really really good um it's not bad it's just like my favorites were the tavern the palace and this one um but everyone will have to leave a comment down below let us know what you think of these three submissions which one would you have picked personally the tavern is my favorite i just feel it's the most cohesive of the shots um i like the angle and things like that it just felt like the most complete if that makes sense um like every element of it was perfect if that makes it easier to understand my point <laughs> but they were all very very good they were all very good no matter what you go with i'm sure these would all get a very good result next up we have Kyle's fantasy with this archaeologist inspired uh snap i really love this you've hidden hey hey so well like legit where is he <laughs> i don't know how you managed to hide him behind the coffee table but you did a good job of doing it um i love all the books the like the telescope all the kind of like archaeological finds um and like the stone slabs the the lion mass the philatites like statue and things like that it all just works really really well i love this it's definitely kind of almost giving professor layton vibes oh my god i should have done a professor layton inspired snap why didn't i think of this before that would have been so good do i have time to change my submission i don't even think i have the right items to do a professor layton inspired snap but that would be so fun i might have to look into it <laughs> i might have to look into it and see if it's something i can do because i would love to do that obviously it'd be totally inspired by your own snap um because this is fantastic this is such a great submission and yeah i really really like this next up we have rora with this submission and i love this the black and white vibes of this like you've got the rift in the background you have the like the projectory thing uh the black and white critic companion oswald your outfit is perfectly coordinated as well and the theater in the background this is such a good submission i love this and there's only like subtle hints of color um which i really really love there's just something aesthetically about this that i adore and i think this is a fantastic submission i think it's so creative and so fun and so playful and i'm sure this is going to do extremely well next up we have fora fora with this circus inspired fit and i love this this is so fun using woody's carousel the like popcorn machines even the little like toontown car that you can cast with the fragments now this is such a good snap i love this it's so fun so creative so well like decorated and things like that i think you've done absolutely amazingly with this setup this is yeah this is fantastic great job 
Next up, we have Cole with the French bakery vibes, and I love this. I love that your character's like right at the very front of the screen. Um, sort of visually, we can like the focus is on you. I love the bakery in the background and how you've decorated with the tables and chairs, and then like put some bakery items on the top. Such a good touch. Obviously, I love the fact that Oswald's running through. Oswald, I'm such a big fan of. I adore Oswald. Um, so yeah, this is lovely to see. I think this is a fun snap. I think it's going to have a lot of appeal to people. And yeah, I think you've done a great job with this. Next up, we have Queen234 with this black and white submission. I love this. I love that you've gone for the black and white filter to really lean into those black and white classic silent cinema vibes i love that you've used the oswald theater his house in the background we obviously have oswald posing here as well and i think you frame the photo nicely with the balloons it's giving very red carpet kind of vibes like that kind of entrance way if that makes sense so yeah i love this submission and i think this is super fun i'm so excited to see how your results are with this challenge Next up, we have Flame G with this submission. And oh my God, this is wonderful. This is so good. Okay, firstly, I love the Mickey Cloud. And thank you for squeezing that in for me. <laughs> I really appreciate it. Definitely guaranteed to get my vote if I see it. That's fantastic. Um, I love this little setup, this kind of like performance setup. And in front of the Hollywood Tower Hotel, this is such a creative backdrop. I really like this. I love this filter that you've used, kind of giving it this old timey effect, almost like how, you know, like old photos from the past kind of get this kind of almost like blur to them. I, I love that. I think aesthetically, this is so good. Um, I love how you've set the camera, you're posing here with Minnie, and I think Minnie works really nicely with this, like your outfits are very cohesive, and the little bunny is super cute too, so yeah, I really like this setup, I think it's so unique, I think it's so eye-catching, and yeah, this is beautiful, great job. Next up, we have Melly B with this circus inspired snap. And I love this. I love how you've got the people queuing up for like the pretzel stand. That's so cute. I love that. I love that you've got like the tent in the background, really reminiscent of like the circus tents and things like that. All the balloons, the popcorn machines. Your outfit is incredible. You look amazing. This is such a stunning submission. I think this is going to do extremely well. Um, yeah, this is just fantastic. So great job with this. Fantastic. Next up, we have my main account, Snap. Now, I really wanted to lean into the kind of like crazy bird lady vibes. <laughs> what i was trying to get um and i really wanted a bird flying at the screen so i did end up settling with this snap like we do have the bird here i do wish he was a bit more prominent towards the front of the screen but it is what it is we've got eric nicely framed in the background <laughs> like it's just so ridiculous it makes no sense but there he is um i love this like posing with the bird we've got another bird here i do wish i could have coordinated the birds better to be like flying in the right direction like coordinated um in that sense um but i think this still works i hope it does give the kind of like crazy bird lady vibes that i wanted it to do which i really wanted it to do to match him with the hat to be honest i do dislike that my outfit is a contrast of colors with like the entire blue and then this bird hat i don't think it's cohesive in that sense but we went for those higher max tags <laughs> um that was the intention with this one so we'll just have to see how it does um and hope for the best i guess um but yeah this is our snap that we went with next up we have emmy bouquet and this 
this is gorgeous this is one of my absolute favorite submissions ever like of all the dream snap challenges i absolutely love this i think this is fantastic it's so elegant so classy i love the filter choice you've gone with i think the filter choice is perfect i love that you've like got the car in the shot the flowers the foliage the door choice is so good also i do want to point out this is an indoor submission. That's the only way you can get those doors is obviously they're an interior door. So this is an indoor build that's built and designed and looks like an exterior build. And I just think that's so fantastic. So creative. You've done such an amazing job here. This, I just think visually this is stunning. This is, this is so good. And I, I just yeah i'm floored i'm absolutely floored this is fantastic and last but not least we have Roll marianne's submission i was so tempted to do a black and white submission like this because of your snap i think your snap is so good i love how you've used oswald's theater you've used the car we have oswald here the black and white companion we've got the little like clock thing i really wish this clock thing was a companion game loft if if you, if you ever listen to me once please make this a companion please i would love to have a little clock following me that would be so cute um and obviously we've got the rift in the background which works so so well um this is just a fantastic little setup i think you've done incredibly with this i think the filter's perfect and yeah this is just a fantastic snap incredible work honestly so there we have it that is the dream snaps we have currently in the discord there will be another video to follow very shortly from this with the other half of the discord dream snaps challenges uh, or submissions i should say um i will be filming the second half on the wednesday or thursday so if you um so make sure you get your submissions posted by then because if not it might not be included in the video so if for whatever reason you've submitted a photo and i haven't gone over it and you've submitted it say on like the thursday or the friday or something like that that will be why i haven't shown it so i do apologize but i am holding off on recording the second half to try and include everyone's submissions as much as possible so anyway i hope you enjoyed this video make sure to stick around for the part two because that will be coming up very shortly if it's not live and posted yet then it will be in the next sort of five to ten minutes i would expect um so yeah i hope you enjoyed this one and i'll see you all in the next video bye guys <laughs>